In the final week of October, Bitcoin finally eclipsed the 70,000 level that had provided resistance since June. The forces driving Bitcoin remain complicated. The election appears to be a catalyst. Also, the prospect of declining interest rates seemed like it should be a tailwind, except that most Treasury rates have moved higher since the Fed's 50 basis point cut in September. Perhaps the biggest driver remains broad-based adoption. Now, in 2023, the narrative was institutional adoption, with companies like BlackRock, Van Eck, and Fidelity increasing their footprint in the space. Perhaps a more recent tailwind is broad adoption in the retail realm with the introduction of reduced size contracts like the CME Group's Bitcoin Friday futures, which have a notional of 1 50th of one coin. The one thing that seems to remain constant is that the Bitcoin faithful view the coin as a hedge against loose dollar policies. Presidential candidates are viewed by the markets as having the potential to increase deficit spending and until proven otherwise, be a catalyst for traditional dollar hedges like gold and potentially upstart dollar hedges like Bitcoin and crypto.